In 1891, the first Anglo-Manipuri War was fought after the British fell to capture Yuvraj Tikendrajit in an attempt which led to the killing of few British officers. After this event, there was an attack by British on the Kingdom of Manipur, the resistance to which led to an inevitable conflict between the major European power and the small princely Kingdom of Manipur. This conflict became unprecedented and came to be known as Anglo-Manipur War of 1891. The mighty British Empire came down upon Manipur from three different directions and a heroic battle pursued at Khongjom where Pauna Brajabasi led from the forefront and so cast unforgettable heroism which went down into the popular history and folklore of Manipur. Today, the magnificent contribution of Pauna Brajabasi to safeguard the dignity, integrity and sovereignty of his motherland are sung by ballad singers popularly known as Khongjom Prabha. Every year, 23rd April is observed as Khongjom Day and all the dignitaries of the state and the people of Manipur pay floral tributes to Pauna Brajabasi for the indomitable courage he showed in the battlefield. Pauna Brajabasi is one of the unsung heroes of Manipur, uh, which is not featured in the limelight of the history in the mainstream Indian history. Uh, his heroic acts is, uh, and the indomitable courage he showed during the First Anglo-Manipuri War of 1891 is uh, famous all over the state of Manipur. And every year uh, on the 23rd of April, uh, the decisive battle which was fought, uh, fought at Kongjong against the British uh, is remembered and observed in, in Manipur every year and dignitaries from all over the state and also the people of Manipur come on this uh, particular day to pay their uh, floral tribute to the hero. His uh, courage is uh, sung by the ballad, by the ballad singers to this day, uh, which is uh, popular in our, pop uh, in our culture, in our Manipuri culture as the Kongjom Parva. Uh, he laid down his life and he sacrificed even his sons for the cause of uh, maintaining the dignity, integrity and the sovereignty of the Kingdom of Manipur, uh, which uh, fell under the attack of the Britishers in 1891. So it, it is very worthwhile and it is very uh, nice that we are remembering this hero on, the, uh, on this occasion of the celebration of the unsung heroes of India. Thank you very much. Paunam Naol Singh, popularly known as Pauna Brajabashi, born on 20 December 1823 in Haubam Laikai, Imphal, Manipur, and died on 23rd April 1891. He is the son of Paunam Tulsi Ram, also known as Laifam Lakpa and Haubam Kunjeshori. He was the only son of his parents. In 1850, Tulsi Ram passed away and Naol Singh left Imphal for Vrindavan. After that, he proceeded to Banaras to learn the art of fighting under the fest of many distinguished masters. In 1856, at the age of 23, he began military career by joining the king's army as a junior officer. Maharaja Chandrakriti led an expedition with a contingent against the surprising Akam of Chin Hills. Here, he played an important role in surprising the uprising. The king promoted him to the post of Subedar and rewarded three hectares of revenue free land along with Ningthaufi. He narrated 
the story of his long stay at Vrindavan to Maharaja, so Maharaja Chandrakriti affectionately called him Brajabashi.